Capability development is subject to time compression diseconomies. The faster a firm grows, the more challenging it is. And this is a fundamental principle for the concept of sustainable competitive advantage. Surprisingly, uh, this is taken for granted in the strategy literature and little um, empirical evidence, uh, little attention is being paid to the origins of this effect. That is how time compression leads to these economies and what are the conditions under which this effect is high or low. The context of fertility clinics is an appropriate lens to test time compression these economies. The UK authorities have been very thorough in recording operational, organizational data about the fertility clinics since the inception of this field in the UK. So we have granular data about the experience accumulated by these clinics across time, two important variables to test these effects. And so we observe that faster the experience accumulation, the shallower the learning curves of these clinics. Moreover, the effect is exacerbated uh, by the fact that uh, some clinics may take on more complex cases. Also, the effect is mitigated if the clinics employ integrator to coordinate across the specialist functions, across the treatment trajectory. We propose that time compression reduces learning, leading to diseconomies in capability building. Our results have implications for managers. As firms pursue new opportunities, it makes sense to grow fast, and there are advantages to such fast-paced growth, such as uh, first-mover advantages or faster payback on investment. However, there's a dark side to such fast-paced growth because the penalty of fast growth is sensitive to the complexities of the task performed in the organization, the organizational coordination in that setting. So our research serves as a warning that faster isn't always better, that in the long run, learning is affected and capability building suffers.